Greetings Internet, DDA here. Gonna start off the official North Kai Tournament Top Cup matches with uh, by traveling with our friend and uh, you know member of Random Number Gaming, my life to- uh, my uh, my lifelong friend Ryan Lewis. This is a top 16 match between him and John Spears. It's a mirror match. Uh, these two gentlemen actually played each other earlier in the tournament i think it was round five that they played and had a a very a much different match than this one so without further ado let's get started and see how this match unfolds so john's gonna go first start off by dropping the visiting rejuving a knee block nice gaining an anger i think one two three i played too many of these because Ryan's uh, actually complaining about the hurried quest that he runs. He, he decided to run three in this tournament. I think not a bad idea given the amount of mirrors he played. Drop fusion, another hurried quest hitting the field. Lots of hurried quests. Not good with no Dragon Balls in play. Dragon Clan, N6, first ball hitting the field. Uh, N5 as well, so two balls hitting the field along with Dragon Clan. Now, as you can see, Ryan actually milled before before drawing, and I think there's a Panini email out there somewhere stating that you do the immediate effects of the Dragon Ball before the Namekian Mastery takes place. But that was a local ruling this day. He's actually debating whether or not to enter. He makes the right choice here. As you can see, the opponent has visiting the past in play as well as confrontation on the top of his discard pile so good idea not to enter he'd be at a strong disadvantage the opponent would have you know maybe what two or three cards on him so he passes uh, what a great draw dropping the, his own dragon clan both both players have their dragon clan the dragon ball searchers on the field now Gives him some Dragon Ball control. Two balls have already hit the field. He has time and right throw in his hand. He's gonna keep the time and rejuvenate Dragon Dragon Rage, Dragon Burning Rage. Did you cut my deck? You mill one. I mill one. I mean, I'm asking. It's on camera. You mill one. I mill one. Lots of balls hitting the field. I can see he uh, he has seven in his hand also, so he's actually going to have now five balls, and I think I caught a glimpse of Dragon Radar, so this is actually, well, this is a straight Luxac here. I mean, you guys, you see the length of this video. It's not a very long video, so I think you see where this is going. Dropping seven. Uh, six is in play, so that's gone. Uh, don't forget that anger, Ryan. So Ryan has two choices here. Well, three choices. Uh, two choices. He can either add or he can not. And based on that, you want to set your top, you, the three you're putting on, your top with seven based on whether or not you're entering now he does have five balls in play I know he has dragon radar in his hand so technically that is all seven dragon balls yes you do have to put three on top Ryan don't forget what you're doing I'm so glad that you know I got this on camera. It's it's something special when you know I make fun of Ryan constantly for slow playing. It's just something special being able to then commentate on a video and, and seeing it showing the world what I'm what I'm talking about. He only has six cards in his discard pile. 
There's not that many choices here. Still unsure. Finally making the decision. Hurry quest, good pull. I mean, with all the balls in play, no reason not to play Hurry Quest at this point. He's going to enter combat, actually, without a hand. Enter combat without a hand, straight grabbing. What did he grab? I think he grabbed confrontation. Ball four has not been played yet, so I think we can all guess what he's going to go for here. Yep, hitting the ball for sealing a big portion of the game with him. Locking him out of any setups he has during combat. Yep, killing the Dragon Clan as well as the fusion. Yep. So I'm not sure why John didn't uh, I'm not sure why John didn't use visiting the past uh, when entering combat. I think he actually says on this video that you know that was a severe misplay. He could have uh, played hurried quest and bounced the ball into Ryan's hand. Ryan being very, very sportsmanlike, letting his opponent know, hey, you know, you got one move. I'm gonna do Dragon Clan. What do you got? I don't have one out, so I mean, if you can do whatever you can do, then I'm gonna drag it. Looks like he's got time, hybrid defense. I think a flinch. Oh uh, no, that was a uh, Dragon Ball Four. Yep, right throw. Wouldn't have done enough damage. Do anything. He had right throw in his power. I mean, the visiting the past definitely would have stalled him at least in other combat. Uh, he would have been able to bounce a ball, probably I would say ball four, so he could then play ball four. Make it much harder for Ryan then to ball out. It's hard to steal that last ball from the Mechian deck, so... Who knows, it could have been a different game then, but overall, you know, overall luck sack by Ryan Lewis. You know, these two players, uh, John Spears, they had a really good match in top four. I mean, uh, in, uh, in round five of the tournament. That lasted about 50 minutes long, but... This one, quick match, you know, can't really get around drawing, drawing into five Dragon Balls as well as two Dragon Ball Searchers, can't really get around that.